Welcome everyone. Um, I'm so excited to be here with you today on this uh, commemoration of uh, Juneteenth. This is the first time that GSA will be raising the flag and you'll hear remarks about what that means for the agency and for our nation. Uh, but as a senior advisor for equity at GSA, I'm just so thrilled that we're able to commemorate this moment, which really is a second independence for America. Um, it was an inflection point in American history where we are able to more fully realize the founding documents and what it means to have freedom and liberty for all. So thank you all for joining us this morning and uh, on this fine, beautiful day to fly a flag. And I'm going to turn it over to Shana, who will give us a little bit more context about the flag itself. Good morning, everyone. GSA provides policy and procedural guidance for flag flying on buildings under its jurisdiction and control. To commemorate Juneteenth, today GSA will fly the Juneteenth flag in honor of the abolishment of slavery on June 19, 1865. The flag features an arc of, that means New Horizons. It features the uh, five-pointed star of Texas, where the 250,000 slaves were emancipated. And it also features a larger star that speaks to new freedoms. Now I turn it over to Katie Kale, our Deputy Administrator. Thank you, Shauna. And it is a beautiful day for a flag. Um, I'm really excited to be here with Robin and Andrea and you and, and Team GSA as we raise the Juneteenth flag over our GSA headquarters. Uh, though the Emancipation Proclamation abolished slavery two years before, it wasn't until June 19th, 1865, when 250,000 enslaved people in Texas finally learned that they were legally free. This day became known as Juneteenth. And it wasn't until 2021 that Juneteenth was established as a federal holiday by the Act of Congress. This new federal holiday is both a celebration and a day of solemn remembrance. It's a day where we are called to reflect on the legacy of systemic injustices and how our nation's find founding ideals can be fully realized in the present day for all Americans because all Americans deserve freedom, equality, and opportunity. Public servants, it is our duty to understand how history impacts people today and work together for a better future where it is possible for everyone. Over to you, Robin. Hey, well, thanks everybody for being here today. I really appreciate it. This is a historic moment uh, because GSA, for the first time in its history, is gonna be raising the Juneteenth flag to commemorate uh, what we've talked about here today, the final abolition of slavery. Um, it's a reminder for all of us that it is our job to do better. If you don't remember this history, you're going to repeat it. It's our job to do better. And raising this flag is just a, a notation of that. It's a very symbolic action for us, but it's not just about flags. It's about living this commitment every day. It's about making GSA an inclusive place to work. It's about the Biden administration's commitment to inclusion, accessibility in whatever we do, whether it's our public buildings, whether it's the websites that we put together, uh, and whether it's the support for small and disadvantaged businesses that we here at GSA work on every day. So very excited to be here. Love that this is a historic moment, that you can share it with us. It is the first time, but not the last, that you'll be seeing this flag over GSA's building.